Now here's Elijah Paul Day, another ex-Canadian junior champion. The sentimental favorite of the audience. I'm not getting an entertainer. Here he is, Elijah Paul Day. Beautiful. His videos have gone viral. Seventeen million of most recognized people on a show. Look His attempt to make the Olympic team. seen this in so long um but man what's it make you think about like what's it make you feel? just everything that i'd been through like everything that i'd been through in my life like in that moment like all the hard stuff all the suffering all the pain it was all worth it for that moment that moment was just like My goal and my dream was Olympic champion. My entire self-worth, who I was, was wrapped around this idea that I was going to be an Olympic champion. And when I came to the realization that maybe that wasn't my path, I fell into the deepest, darkest place of my life because I completely lost a sense of identity. I didn't know who I was anymore. They took the top three. Skating wasn't fun. It's a job, it's work, you're training, you're competing, you're trying to get results. You forget why you do what you do. You forget why you fell in love with the sport. I had to accept the fact that I was enough without the title of being an Olympian. That journey to there was the most difficult, scary, but beautiful and important part of my life. The part that I struggled with the most was this idea that I needed to fit into a mold in order to be successful. I was told things like, oh, you can't skate to that, or you can't wear that because judges won't like it, or you can't wear your hair out because it looks nappy, it looks dirty. So all of these messages were coming to me and subconsciously were registering as, well, what I am and who I am is not what this sport wants. When most of us think of ice skating, we think of beautiful dance routines, sometimes couples that the love songs. That's just one of the stereotypes. Our next guest is shattering. When I stepped onto the ice for the first time, the feeling is different. The fact that you're skating on ice that was formed by Mother Nature is a completely different experience. It's smoother than any indoor rink that I've ever skated on. It's soft. I take one push and glide to infinity. That feeling was just so mesmerizing to me. I fell in love with that right away. I needed more of that every day for the rest of my life. <laughs> reconnecting to nature. Being able to fill my cup is so much easier now. I'm so grateful to have found these beautiful ways to reconnect, to 
be able to find that playfulness again. I didn't even care anymore if I went to the Olympics or not. I didn't need to step onto the ice ever again for a competition. I knew deep down in the deepest part of my heart that I was enough.